light bulb. Okay, hi everybody. This is the Ruby's Pantry for May. And this is what, $40. You pay $40 and this is um, what we came home with. Wide variety of items this time, wide variety. So, we're gonna do the frozen first. We're gonna do the frozen first and then we'll get that put away. So, let me also clarify the $40 is two shares worth. And then I also wanna state that items we can't use or too much of, we actually share it with our family and friends, okay? Um, very seldom do we keep all this for ourselves. So two big bags of french fries and it looks like, almost like McDonald's french fries, doesn't it? Sometimes it says, don't they look like McDonald's? What's the it doesn't say, just open this end. Mm. But it looks like McDonald's. So two of those, and then these are starting to thaw. Okay. Um, chicken? Yeah. You know what? I bet this is buffalo chicken because doesn't that look like yeah, buffalo, like sauce? buffalo sauce? So we'll have to try that. And then two of these, rising crust, spinach, mushroom, and garlic. We'll try that. I haven't tried that kind from Mama Cozy. This is an Aldi's brand. That I know. I haven't tried this. And that's another real reason I like doing the rubies. We get stuff we never would try otherwise. You know what I mean? So, okay, now hold on. Turn it on the brock. And then the last thing I think that we gotta get in the freezer are two boxes. Oh. I think they're breakfast brats. <gasps> Should I open them? Well, well, read what it says. Spicy sunrise smoked link with cheese, onion, green pepper, scrambled eggs, and a soft. Oh. Now let's open them here. Yeah, that's not brats. I bet that's like a breakfast burrito or something. Okay. I don't know. I didn't know Johnsville made that kind I of stuff. I didn't either. See, and that's the other thing, too. I wonder if they give some things to these rubies so that we try it. Oh, these might be delicious. Spicy sunrise. Oh, it's a, like a, what are they called? What are they called? Pigs in a blanket Pigs or a hot dog blanket. in a blanket? A link with cheese, onion, green pepper, scrambled eggs, and a soft baked roll. So it's breakfast, but might, you could really eat it anytime. Might have to try one of them at three o'clock tomorrow morning. Oh yeah, you gotta be to work at 4.45. Or you might try one now, right? Because you haven't eaten yet today and it's almost, what, eight? So two boxes of these and I'm assuming... They're the same. Dozen in each, are there? Probably, I don't know. Fully cooked, keep frozen. Okay, so we're going to pause, and we're going to put this stuff in the freezer, and then we'll come back. Okay, so we counted the Johnsonville smoked sausage in the roll, 10 in a box. Okay. Then, someone before Russ didn't want two of their cans. So, she must have bought two shares, too, if there were two left over. So one can, let me separate this, what I'm talking about. One can was a share, so we did two. And then the lady before us didn't want hers, so she gave them to us. So we have four number 10 cans, and we do know for sure, because somebody did open these, green beans. I don't know how they're cut, French cut, kitchen cut, whatever they're called. Who cares? So I have not repackage these in the past and we just ate green beans for like a week i might repackage these and what i think i can just water bath them i don't think i have to pressure can them i will have to look that up so i might repackage these actually i probably have to pressure can them because there's no acid in them. okay or we just eat green beans for a week which isn't terrible 
Then, which is kind of exciting, I don't think we'd get excited, Smucker's Grape Jelly. Delicious. Smucker's, you need grape jelly, Smucker's is it. So, for those that like sauerkraut, we have tons of sauerkraut. But, this time, I really am looking forward to trying this. It's made with craft beer. So I really want to try this. And it's nice that it's not in a 10 can, number 10 can. We can, you know, like, this is a couple meals for us. There's just two of us. So I'm looking forward to this. My nose keeps running. Honey and peanut nut butter. So granola. And this brand is very good. I don't, rec I don't remember who this is. Sorry, but it's good. The last time we got granola, it's delicious. I put it in my yogurt. Mmm, it was wonderful. Chocolate chip cookies. Four. Four of those. Uh, two wheat breads, a rye, which is my favorite. Three wheat breads. This we know is Walmart. These could be anybody. This, oh, Pig Blue Wiggly. And we freeze the bread. We freeze the bread. Then we actually did get two of these, but Russ, knowing that I don't care for white chocolate, tried one and he says they're delicious. So we actually did get two of these. Then we have two Tropical Punch. We'll try it. Otherwise, we can give it to the neighbors who has kids. They might like it. I don't know. We'll see. Two bags of uh, flavored sunflower seeds, still pickle. So Russ will probably take them to work. He's saying yes. So that's good. Let me blow my nose. Let me blow my nose. Okay. All right. Come on, Liz. There we go. Two bags. I don't know how many are in each. I don't know if they count them or whatever. The Go Macaron Bars. What flavor? Coconut and almond butter and chocolate chips. Ooh. That'll be good. Yeah, that'll be good. These are very good. So two bags of those, and I think they're usually all the same. Yep. So 10 pounds total of red potatoes. That'll be great. I might just end up canning them actually, or, or I don't know, we'll see. Water, wonderful water. Can never go without water. Uh, I've never had these, but Snyder's, how can you go wrong with Snyder's? Twisted pretzel sticks, and I've had their butter, which are delicious. So this though is onion, garlic, and pepper. So. I'm assuming they'll be delicious too. Four bags of Brussels sprouts. Now I'm probably positive we can freeze these. I know you can pickle them. I know you can can them. So I'm gonna check and double make sure that I can freeze these tomorrow. So we should really put these in the fridge tonight. Then two bags of tortilla chips. Excellent. And two containers. Oh, look at that flavor. I didn't notice that. Old fashioned. That'll be interesting. Let's see if this is the same thing I just own. Yep. So we can get out our little containers for our coffee pot. That will be delicious. So, again, Ruby's Pantry. Anybody can go. Absolutely anybody can go. Um, they do it just drive through once the. Um, COVID stuff started, they just did drive through so you don't even have to sign up. You just go, you pay, you get in line, you pay them their money, you say one or two shares at this one, and it's, it's fast. Try it out, look it up, um, rubiespantry.com. I will try and remember to put a link in the description. If not, just send me a comment and I'll give it to you. It's, it's I'm more than willing to share, okay? I do remember, the last time we got spicy Johnsonville brats, I think. We're going to try it. The weather got really cold on us. 
So we are going to try it and I'll let you know how they are because I've never had them yet still. Okay. Thanks for watching. Go get some. Go get some food. Bye.